Before placing ECG leads on the patient, you want to make sure you pick the correct quatrode with the correct ECG cable. There are five types of ECG cables, standard, CV, neonatal, advanced filter, and advanced apps, that pair with the three different quatrodes, standard, CV, or neonatal. For this training, we will focus on the two most versatile and commonly used cables. The Advanced Filter ECG cable is designed to minimize the gradient artifact on the ECG trace for all patients. This cable can be used with any of the quatrodes. The Advanced Apps ECG cable is designed to allow for wide electrode placement on patients with greater surface area of the chest, such as female or overweight patients. This cable is designed to be used with the CV quatrodes. Not using the correct ECG cable with the correct quatrode will affect your ECG output. You may get increased artifact. After you have chosen which cable and quatrode to use, the next step is to prep the patient. It is important to shave any patients with excessive chest hair. If the hair creates an arc behind the quatrode, it can be a burn hazard. After the patient is shaved, use the skin prep gel on the areas where the quatrodes will be placed and briskly rub the selected site or sites with the gauze pad. The skin may turn pink. This gel is an exfoliator and gets rid of dead skin cells. Wipe excess after scrubbing. Tips. The skin prep gel will clean and enhance the skin, which will improve the ECG performance. You will be less likely to get artifact. Alcohol swabs break down the conductive properties of the skin and degrade the ECG performance. When placing the CV quatrodes, you will go to the imaginary nipple line at the fourth intercostal space and place two on either side of the nipple. Then place the other two below on the lower half. All of them will be to the left of the sternum. Do not center them on the chest. If the patient has a large breast, the lower two quatrodes go under the breast tissue, not over it. After placing the quatrodes, make sure the ECG cables do not cross. When using the standard quatrode, place it below the imaginary nipple line. The patch will be on the left side and not in the center of the chest. Tip: For patients with larger breasts, Place the standard quatrode underneath the breast tissue. When using the neonatal quatrode, the patch will be placed in the center of the chest. Once you have placed the quatrodes, you will want to refer to the ECG reference line on the MR200 to see if you have good signal strength. The ECG signal should be at least one millivolt, that is, the waveform should be equal to the size of the scale indicator. In some cases, a 1 millivolt ECG signal cannot be achieved due to patient physiology. In these cases, try to achieve the largest amplitude attainable. If it is not, then you will most likely get artifact. If you prepped your patient correctly and placed the quatrodes but are still not getting a 1 millivolt ECG signal, there are a couple of things you can try. In some cases, a 1 millivolt ECG signal cannot be achieved due to patient physiology. Tips. If you start your scan and you begin to get artifact, go ahead and try to change the filter. These filters were made to decrease artifact that may be caused by the MR scanner. Place the module on a cushioned surface, such as a blanket or towel, to minimize MR scanner vibrations. When storing the module after the case, make sure to store it downwards where the leads are hanging. Storing it upwards will stress the cables and eventually break them. Mm -hmm.